So here we go. On the left-hand side, in our chord sorts, we've taken all the 1-1 one, one interval pairs, which are consonants 1, and we've sorted them by the chord root, D through B flat. And over here, we're playing them. Yay. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a recap of Composing for Change Part 8, New Ground. In today's episode, we reflected and re-entered that vocal singing is becoming a thing in this series. We've been wanting to go more and more to live performance since the last series. One way we've been doing it is playing, you know, chord cadences live. which is a little stilted but works, and another way has been to start singing live, which we did in the last uh, part. Um, we also reflected that we've been returning to our source about automating chords. So here's what happened. At our open mic, we sang the wheel here. We harm, we blame, we breathe. Little flat there. We profit, we react, we breathe. And a little better. We conceal, we reveal, we choose, now we're on spec. we breathe. We act, we advance, we breathe. So there's room to improve on that. However, we were very excited because we sang live and they liked it. We also did our continuing reading poems. So, uh, as an example, this is a poem. Every. I used to swim when I was younger. I floundered first and then took lesson. However, we usually read these poems twice. We wrote these. So, we made a duet out of it with a little pan left, pan right, like this. Every. I used, I used to, swim to swim when, when, I, was when I was younger. I floundered, I floundered first, and, first then took and then took lesson. And then we also played around with putting a little reverb in there, and we kind of got this. Every. I used, I used to, swim to swim when, I was, when I was younger. I floundered, I floundered first, and, first then and then took lesson. Which is all good, but we decided to keep it uh, pan, but no reverb. Then we went into our, we'd been working on this overlapping. Uh, animation and overlapping circles thing so what we're going to do now is play this animation for you with that song that poem it's not a song yet it's a poem but we kind of like it the the two circles here so we go boom every i used, I used to, to swim when i was, when younger. I was younger i floundered, I floundered first, and, first then took lessons. and then took lessons my skills, my skills improved, improved until, until I, reached I reached the limits, the limits to my to time, my time and, and, will. and will. For every For skill, every this, skill does occur, this does occur, it serves, it serves to, to show, show my true intentions. My true intentions. Every. So that was pretty cool, we thought. That was pretty cool. Pretty cool. Kind of combining things. New ground, as the theme of today is. Now, moving on to returning to our source and, and all that. Well, we had just finished updating these red chords and hitting the full 120. We had just gotten around to the point of getting the, the Do Re Mi scale with all 120 chords in the new full sort, sort order. But we wanted to start composing with it, and we wanted to add an interval pair sort. So that's what we mean by it took us back kind of to our roots, because um, we, we went ahead and made a, updated our chord concordance, which is um, all the possible chords, 120 of them. See down here, 120, 120. And this is our what we call the canonical sort order. It's minor comes first, and then tonic and subdominant, dominant within minor, blah, 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 blah. But we wanted to be able to sort it, so we generated second columns for what's the root, what's the mode, what's the function, what's the interval pair, what's the consonants. And this is what we are working with right now. We're going from lowest one 
to highest consonants, which is 3. And then within that consonants, we're going to climb the interval pairs. Now, there was only one ones in here. But when we get around to this one, we've got all these 1, 2 chords. Then we can jump to 1, 3 chords. Then we can jump to 1, 5 chords, and so on. And they're all the same consonants. So we're going to look forward to hearing how this sounds. But what we're going to do now is going to play, once again, this beginning chord sorts composition. Here we go. And what we like about it is we can build in the ascending feel. We can have it in the back of our mind locked into the same interval pair, which in this case is 1-1. One, one. Uh, we do know that this is going tonic, tonic, dominant, 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 dominant. So it's kind of going from a, a, a resty energy to an urgy energy. That's fine because all of these are going to go somewhere too. We know what they're going to be. And this has given us a quick way. We just go into here and we copy, you know, that chord. Like if we're ready to do the next one, we're going to have to copy a D12 which is right there. We'll just copy it over here and we'll start a new line. And we'll start a new line, add, add a measure, you know, say, okay, now we're going to start the, uh, the, well, we forgot to copy it. We got to copy this. Copy you, paste you, and then that's going to be the 1.7 consonants. 1.7. So we're just kind of, and we've made the analogy metaphor over and over and over again that spending all the time generating these reference scores is like grinding pigments and mixing them with oils. So you have paint in little pots and, you know, the, the, there's only 12 primary pigments, you know, C, C sharp, D, D sharp, etc. And then then you mix those pigments in certain combinations and you get 120 separate colors. And how do you pick and choose using those colors? Or if you want to use all of them, which we always like to do, what order do you put them in? You know, what kind of, what's the rainbow order up, down, uh, all around? And so that's why we are so excited to have this concordance, sortable concordance to work with. And so that's what we're going to this ends today's stream, which does bring us to our ideas for next time are to continue with the chord scores, chord sort score and uh, to be determined because we've got these other things that are on the on the hoof. Uh, shout outs to Mr. Spatz and Miss Cleo who stopped by. We appreciate you. Do come back. Do take care and do keep on streaming. <laughs>